Well, man, one man who's going to have a lot of cash to flash in the shops is a new millionaire. Alan Rowley from Eastwood in Nottinghamshire runs a cleaning company and has won almost £2 million. But after cleaning up in the National Lottery, will Alan be giving up the day job? Simon Ward has been to meet him. A sparkling celebration for Alan Rowley in the grounds of a posh hotel. Last year, he was made redundant from a printing firm in Derby. So he started his own cleaning company. Now life has got even better for the married father of two. Now this is my new best friend, Alan, who's just won almost £2 million on the lottery. Tell us what happened. How did you find out? Um, I got an email on Monday morning from National Lottery saying that I was a winner and to log on to my account to see how much I'd won. And when I logged on to my account, uh, it told me that I'd won £1,925,567. Wow. With his big win, the credit crunch won't be biting. But will Alan be packing up the cleaning business? No, we're definitely going to carry on the business. Um, but myself and my business partner will now sort of just concentrate on running the business and we'll employ some extra staff to do the work that, that we were doing. So, yes, I'll still be running the business, and, uh, but I'll be doing it as a more sort of backseat role from now on. So almost two million pounds, what are you going to do with the money? Um, we've been looking at um, some larger property uh, we might have a caravan at the seaside, which is something the wife's always wanted. Uh, and uh, we've been looking at a few cars, and so I don't want to drive around town in my uh, cleaning van any longer. So, Alan, I was just wondering, any chance you could lend me some money? Uh, well, I was hoping, actually, you'd pick up the tamp of the champagne, because the funds haven't cleared yet. You want me to pay for this? Uh, that'd be very nice of you. Thank you. Simon Ward in Eastwood in Nottinghamshire, a bit poorer for Central tonight. Oh, well done to you. Uh, great news.